Okay guys, I got my first mail at my P.O. box. I've got two things that I'm gonna share with you guys. I'm really excited that it was so cool because I've, I've only been to check the P.O. box twice and both times I went to check it, there was something in it. So ah, this is the very first piece of mail that I received in my P.O. box. So thank you very much to Gwendolyn for sending this to me and I'm going to show you what it is. Oh, it's a Kish card. How cool is that? I love it, I love it. I love doll stationery and other doll lifestyle items. I think it is so sweet. So, all right, let's see what's inside. Hi Allison, I thought I'd drop you a little note to let you know how much I appreciate you and all you do in the doll world. Sincerely, Gwen. Gwen, thank you so much for taking the time out to send me this. Look how, ha like, oh my gosh, it's so exciting. Like. Oh my gosh, I love this. I love this so much. Gwen, thank you for sending, taking the time to send this to me. Stuff like this is, you know, it's just fun. I used to, if you guys ever had a pen pal, you know how exciting it is just to get a handwritten card or letter. It's just so much fun, especially since, you know, the days we all spend a lot of time online reading emails and stuff like that. And, and it takes more time to do something like this and it's so special. So I'm gonna treasure this card. Thank you very much, Gwen. I also received this. It is in a bubble envelope. I love the stamps on the back. That is so sweet. So I don't know what's in here. So let's check it out and see what it is. And when I tell you I was so excited when I, when I got my first piece of mail in that P.O. box, I was so excited. All right, so let's see. We've got, here is a card. Let me get it open. Oh, this is cool. This is really cool. Oh, this is really cool. Okay, this is from Audrey. I really enjoy watching your videos. I made these dolls and I hope you enjoy them. I am a big doll collector, especially older dolls, but I really like seeing all the new dolls you show on your videos. From Audrey. Oh my gosh, this is so cool. This is like a vintage, this is like a vintage um, like magazine that she created this card out of that's super cool that's really unique i love that all right so let's check out what's in the little packages this is a really cute pink velvet ribbon let's see really pretty tissue paper oh my gosh that's so cool how cool is that oh this totally is my Libra vibes too, y'all. This is all about, look at that cute, I love how pretty that is, that face painting. This is so, so Libra vibes. I love it, I love it. I'm in the mood for fall. Look at the print on this, oh, I love it. And then the, the face, oh my gosh, Audrey, I love it, this is perfect. I'm thinking of the perfect place to put this in my doll room right now. Let's check out the other one, let's see. Mm -hmm. Also really pretty tissue paper. Oh, how cute. With the little cat patch. These are adorable. These are really, really fun, cute items. Look at this. She's got like a, um, she's so cute. Oh my goodness, I love it. I love it so much. Thank you so much, Audrey. These are the kind of fun things like the add to, you know, doll displays and the add to your doll pictures and things like that. They're just really cute items to add in. So I love this so much and I'm going to start an album with all of my dolly correspondence. I have all my doll, I have some doll correspondence now that I keep in a, like in a file cabinet, but that doesn't feel right. So I'm gonna do some kind of album to keep all my doll correspondence in. If you guys have like an idea or you know of a good album that's great for keeping like greeting cards and letters and stuff, let me know because I would love to check something like that out so I can get organized and keep all this stuff because I wanna keep everything that, that people take the time to send me. I, lo I love this so much. 
I went back to the post office and I had two more pieces of mail, so I wanted to show those to you guys for the mail call. So I got a postcard from Tammy. It says, Dear Allison, I'm excited to meet you in September at the Modern Doll Convention in Oklahoma City. I'm excited to meet you too, Tammy. I know it's going to be a lot of fun. Yes, it will be. I have been so excited about this convention. I've been talking about it with my friend Lindsay like nonstop for the past couple weeks because we are just super pumped to go. Here's Waylon. He's not pumped that I'm going at all because he's going to be home alone with Daddy, but that's okay. Um, she will be, I will be there with my husband. Love your channel on YouTube, Dolly Friend Tammy. So Tammy, thank you so much for taking the time to write to me. You're gonna have to stop me. Say hi at Modern Doll. I can't wait to see you. It's gonna be, you're gonna love it. It's gonna be so much fun. All right, I also got a package of what says our doll clothes on the customs information. So this is exciting. This is my first international package to my P.O. box. So let's check out what's inside. We're gonna have to go grab a dolly when we figure out what size this is so we can try it on. So here we go, we've got some, let's see, make sure I didn't miss anything in here, I don't think so. So, oh, here we go, there's a card in here. So let's open this up and check it out. This is really beautiful. This is really beautiful paper. Oh, it's like silver and it's, look at this string. This is like hand dyed string. Wow, that's gorgeous. That's absolutely gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. Okay, let's see. So the card says, Dear Allison, thanks for creating great dolly content. I really enjoy it. Thanks to you, I've learned to understand my love for dolls and also how the world of doll collecting works. My favorite doll game is making clothes for them, so I thought it would be great to hear your opinion on my creations. There are also some bracelets. I like to use them sometimes as belts or headbands for dolls. That's a really good idea. I like that. If you like, you can also visit my little shop in Etsy, Annika Crafts 5A. We will, I will list that below in the video description so you guys can check it out. This card is not my original artwork. It is created following a tutorial on YouTube channel, Visual Mind. If you don't mind, that channel deserves a big shout out. So Visual Mind on YouTube and she created this card. Look how beautiful this is. That is gorgeous. You know, that's something that I know a lot of people, a friend of mine who is a nurse, she um, likes to paint for relaxation. She's actually a doctor now. She's not a nurse anymore, she's a doctor. Big shout out to her too. But painting is such a relaxing thing. This is beautiful, Annika, I love it. It's so gorgeous. I love things like this too. These are the types of things that I frame and put around my doll room because they're really gorgeous and to me, the fact that, that you took the time to do this is just, it's gorgeous. I love it. All right, so let's check out what she sent. We've got, I love this, this string here. The cat just left some cat dirt on the table, as cats do. We're still learning how to live with these extra cats around here right now. So here are the bracelets. Oh, those are gorgeous. Those are really gorgeous. So they're human bracelets, but we can use them as headbands or belts for dolls, or I might wear them as a bracelet. You never know, because I actually almost wore a green dress today. This would look really great with the dress I was gonna wear today. That's really pretty. So we'll use them for something, either dolls or myself. That's beautiful, absolutely gorgeous. I love that. Let's check this out, let's see. Um, I love these strings too. I'm gonna use those strings as um, ties in my doll hair. Let's see, okay, oh look! Like some little, a little frilly top. That is so cute. And socks, and look, a little, little um, shorts. Oh, these are so cute. What size are these? Are these, I'm trying to think. We got two, these are gorgeous. Should I mix them like this? Like miss? No, I think I should keep them like this. Those are precious. I'm gonna go find a doll to put them on and show them to you guys before the end of this. I love those. I love the little frills on. I love the fabric choice. I love the purple socks, of course, and I love the frills on it. Like this is a really cool, like um, accent fabric. I really like that. That's gorgeous. Absolutely beautiful. So, and then we have another package here. Let's see what's inside of this one. You know, that might fit Palerina or Little Darling or maybe like a, like a Little Fee. Might be a little too big for a Little Fee. 
I'm just thinking. It's hard for me to eyeball stuff and know. And the thing about me is I have so many dolls, it'll fit somebody. So <laughs> that's, I'm always able to use doll clothes. All right, so let's check this one out. Very well wrapped, made a long journey here. Okay, so let's see this one. This is just so beautiful. I love the wrappings on these things. Really love the wrappings. All right, this one is, oh, that is amazing. So we've got like a knitted pair of long pants. You know what I wanna put this on is a Pongratz. I think this will fit a Pongratz really well. This is really nice. I like that. Wow, that's beautiful. And then let's check this out. And this is a nice this is a nice fabric here. Oh wow. Oh, it's purple and this is beautiful, y'all. This is like a big I think this is American Girl size. This is a big like beautiful cardigan, but you guys know I'm like obsessed with getting a big Stella doll. This is gonna look amazing when I finally get my big Stella, like my big Connie Lowe Stella. Oh, it could be a dress or a cardigan. Like if you look at the back, the way that the belt is in there, and then we've got a hat. Oh, and we've got a muff too, like a hand warmer muff. Look at that, that and it's got beautiful like beading there, like really pretty iridescent beads. Oh, this is so gorgeous, Annika, I love it. Thank you so much. Oh, beautiful, beautiful. All right, I'm gonna go try this on some dolls and come back so you guys can see it, how it looks on the dolls. And I'll of course link her Etsy shop below in the video description, Annika Crafts 5A. So um, hang on and I'll be right back. I put the knitted tights on the Palerina doll. I think they look super cute. They will also look good on a Pongratz doll and eventually I probably will move them to a Pongratz doll, but I wanted to show them to you guys on her. Then I put the purple one on my K wig doll. Now I'm actually gonna really save this for one of my big Stella dolls because I am going to get a big Stella and possibly family members if I'm lucky, but I wanted to show it to you guys on an MSD BJD. It's really, really cute. I think it's adorable. And I like the way that it ties in the middle. Like I put it over the dress she was wearing, but I think you could do it alone or over something the way I have it here. Very, very cute. And then these little outfits were little fee sized. I put it on my Nikki Britt Adeline because Shira and I were actually talking about this doll this morning. And she asked me, um, she hadn't seen her in a while. I was like, you know what? I'll bring her out and I'll put her in this outfit and show you. And how cute is that? I love the little, the way the little um, ruffle there has the little midriff bear between the little shorts and the top. So that is super duper cute. So Annika, thank you so much for sending me this stuff. Guys, I love, you know what I love about the post office box? I'm so glad I got a PO box because you have to intentionally go to check the mail and it's really exciting when there's something there. It's like, it's like a little, it's like a little treat. You know, you're taking yourself to the mailbox and you know, I get a postcard and I love it. I get a card and I love it. I get beautiful things that you guys have made and I love that. And so I'm very appreciative, 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 appreciative to you guys for your support and for sending me these things. I really love it. So if you want to be part of the next mail call, um, you can feel free to send me a postcard. My PO box is listed in the video description below. I will also link Annika's store in the video description below so you guys can check it out and see her cute things that she makes for dolls. Thanks guys so much for watching and we'll see you in the next video. Bye bye. I want to say a huge thank you to my patrons from Patreon. Lindsay S, Leah W, Doreen Z, Janice H, Mercedes W, Cindy K, Bear Sunflower, Diane B, Kelly L, Cindy L, Susie W, Krista R, Victory Run, Shorna R, Shara Star Hobby, Stephanie W, Jessica S, Ray M, Asia C, Black Y, and Shalane C. Your support means so much to me and helps me continue bringing you great Dolly content. For more information on how you can become a supporter of this channel, please check the link in the video description. Thank you so much for watching.